Hey guys, it's YXBA and today I just wanted to do a quick video because the Nintendo NX just got another game announced. So what game was announced for the NX? Well, it doesn't have an official name yet, but it is a new Sonic the Hedgehog game that is being developed by the same teams that made Sonic Colors in 2010 and Sonic Generations in 2011 and the game is basically being designed to honor the 25th anniversary of Sonic. So I guess what better way to honor Sonic's legacy than to make sure the game comes to a Nintendo console. I'm sure there's some Sega fans out there that cringe every time Sonic appears on a Nintendo console, but for me, obviously, as a Nintendo fan, I think it's great. So this game has also been announced for PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC. Not much you can really read into this. You know, Sonic games are very traditional games, but we did already have hints at a traditional game like Dragon Quest XI coming to the NX, and we do have, obviously, Zelda Breath of the Wild also coming to the NX, so being a traditional game doesn't reveal a whole lot about the console. The only thing that you can maybe say about this announcement I think is that it's kind of surprising that it's not coming to the Wii U because the Wii U has been home to several Sonic games and I'm sure they would have been able to milk a decent number of sales from the Wii U console but maybe the game is too graphically intense for the Wii U to handle and only something maybe at Xbox One or higher in terms of power is able to support the game. Again, not much is known about the title, but they did show a teaser trailer, which I am looping in this video, and they did announce that it's coming holiday 2017. So, as I was saying, it doesn't really reveal a whole lot, in my opinion, about the system, but it's definitely nice to get another game announced, and it seems like right now, Nintendo is selectively allowing certain games to be announced as coming to the NX. They allowed for Just Dance to be announced for the NX, and they have allowed for this game to be announced for the NX as well. Although, when Square Enix tried to announce Dragon Quest XI, they had to quickly retract that statement. So I'm thinking that, again, this is an example of a game that probably isn't big enough of an announcement to really be featured heavily at Nintendo's debut event for the NX system, whenever that ends up being, and it doesn't really reveal anything about the console. Whereas, had it been a completely different game, for example, a game like For Honor, getting announced for the NX, well, that would give a very clear direction in terms of power of the system. We would know that the system was probably at least as powerful as Xbox One or more. Whereas this game, you know, it could be a 2D Sonic game. We don't quite know. The only thing I have to go on is it's not coming to the Wii U for some strange reason, but it doesn't really, really 100% reveal anything about the system. Probably the most intriguing thing about this announcement was the use of a logo that would likely have been given to them from Nintendo for NX. It's very interesting that it doesn't say Nintendo NX, it just says NX. And then below, in the fine print, is the only place where it actually talks about Nintendo, which has been leading people to believe that it may very well be that NX will end up being the final name of the system. I guess at this point in time we still have to wait and see, but this is a bit of a subtle hint that the system might end up being called the NX. I'd be interested to know what you guys think about that possibility. So those are my thoughts on this. It's obviously exciting to get a game revealed for the NX and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please click like, and if you want to hear more from me, please subscribe.